Hi friends, I am Dr. Gaurav Agrawal. I am a pediatric cardiologist working at Children Heart Care, Delhi. In previous video, we have discussed the types and symptoms of TAPVC, total and armless pulmonary venous connection. In this video, we will discuss how do we diagnose and treat TAPVC in pediatric case group. For making the diagnosis of TAPVC, the best modality is to do pediatric echocardiogram from the chest of the baby. This is just like an ultrasound uh, test of the heart in which we can make almost 97 to 99% of the TAPVC by doing pediatric echocardiogram. Supplementary test can be either in the form of chest X-ray and ECG and sometimes we have to do CT NGO of the heart in which uh, we can make almost 100% of the TAPVC diagnosis and uh, it has to be done when echo is not conclusive in few cases when the patient presented late later part in the life for example after few years or few months then we are not sure whether the patient is still operable or not then we have to do cardiac catheterization uh, in which we have to enter into the heart from the thigh vessels we enter into the heart and we take the pressures in different chambers of the heart and we can make a conclusion whether the patient is still operable or not so these are the tests that we can do in uh, making the diagnosis of TAPVC. After making the diagnosis, what is the treatment option? The treatment option is only open heart surgery. I am very straightforward in saying that we cannot treat this uh, illness without open heart surgery. And, and timing of treatment will depend uh, whether there is an obstruction in TAPVC is there or not. If there is obstructed TAPVC, then we have to treat this TAPVC as an emergency by open heart surgery. If there is no obstruction, then we have to treat this TAPVC by three, two to three months of age, ideally. Sometimes we can delay by six months of age. A patient came at 17 year uh, of age and that patient was a female and uh, the parents were not aware whether the child is having some form of congenital heart disease. We did the icon, we made the diagnosis of TAPVC, we did the cardiac catheterization, we found the patient is still operable. Uh, we did the operation on that child and the patient is doing fine after four years of surgery. So the message from this video is whenever there is a diagnosis of TAPVC, parents should understand that they should not wait for an option that is without open heart surgery. Uh, I am just saying that treatment is only by open heart surgery. Please don't delay the treatment. And uh, for more detail, you can log into my website, childrenheartcare.com. Thank you very much.